In this video, James Smith takes Veronica's request, evaluates it, and forwards it for further resolution. James starts with a list of requests. In order to simplify navigation and ease to use, the service desk allows you to sort tickets into different views that can be customized by the user. It is also possible to display the list as a table if preferred. In the table, he can then sort and filter requests more easily, for example by requester, request number, name, or current target, just like in a standard Excel spreadsheet. Using filters, he can reduce the number of tickets to quickly find Veronica's request. Then he assigns it to the solution. The system automatically sends instructions for the next step to email. In the request, he finds a message from Veronica describing her problem. He can also find the next step's instructions in the Solving Process tab. The first step requires an analysis of the current computer. The workflow here can be freely modified according to the type of service, each step can be automated according to the status of the request as well as conditional on meeting some criteria. The General tab contains information about the requester, including contact details and assets Veronica is responsible for. By clicking the computer icon, he can quickly access asset management. Here he finds all the necessary information about the computer. He sees the technical configuration such as the operating system, memory, and hard disk capacity. Hardware and software inventory information is available thanks to a discovery by an Alveo software agent. There is even the date of purchase and a warranty that has already expired. He will also find a complete history of the computer, including any technical problems that the computer has had. He can also instantly create a related service request. If he wanted to clearly find out more information about Veronica, he goes across to the object tree, where he can see all the information about a particular user. But he can also find information about any other user or device that the company has. Given the information he has found, James decides that the best thing to do is to order a new laptop and so he forwards the request for approval. Additionally, he can add a message to the approver. The status of the request is then changed in the workflow. In this case, it is automatically passed to James's supervisor David. Anyway, the approval scheme is completely configurable. If James does not know the approver, the approval tab allows him to quickly find the relevant name. If you have any questions, contact us at info at alveo.com. For more videos, visit our Alveo channel and subscribe to be sure that you will not miss any news.